be gay or admit that I wasn't gay and that I was just having what they call the spiritual battle. That was the choice Inoke Tonga says he had to make, a gay man, but also a volleyball coach at Valor Christian High School. He says this happened during a conversation with the school's campus pastor and athletic director. And they started the conversation saying that somebody, a uh, staff member, had found something on my Facebook of um, an interview and being highlighted as a gay man and me identifying as a gay man. Valor says that post suggested Tonga may not support the school's beliefs around sexuality and marriage. Tonga was planning to coach volleyball for a second season with the school, but after this conversation last week, he says he decided to leave. Um, they did say it was a danger to be in front of the kids. Um, sorry. Um, and that to protect the kids, I couldn't be in front of them. Tonga says staff gave him the option to stay under certain conditions. I had to denounce being a gay man, um, cut off any goals I had of marrying the love of my life and um, delete the posts and then also accept their help to becoming a child of God. Um, and I just felt immediately um, that denouncing who I was was never going to be an option. In a statement, the school says they agreed with Tonga that a separation was appropriate. I thought of my boys, thought of my girls. Um, sorry. Um, and that's ultimately, you know, after a day, after two days, ultimately why I decided to speak up. After sharing his story, Tonga says he's received an overwhelming amount of support from parents and strangers. That's motivating him to continue coaching somewhere else. It's, it's humbling. It's very humbling for me. Kelly Rinky, Nine